Celtics Eiffel TV in association with OFL TV. With me I have Stephen Ward. That's the worst Irish accent I've ever heard. It's not Irish. It sounds sort of half German. Or <laughs> <laughs> How are you Stephen? Good, good, good. good. Everything's good. All good? Living the dream, living the dream. Absolutely. This gym is quite, I didn't realise actually without thinking about it, how many pros are in this gym? Aye. Established pros as well. Yeah, yeah, it's packed. I'm just I'm lucky enough to be in with them and all as well now, you know. It's, it's buzzing to you, Martin, Rocky, you know, Tommy, we've got obviously Frampton, which is down the list a wee bit, um, Karma, Cummings, you know, everyone, Mark Leach and all, it's brilliant, it's going really well. Absolutely. Um, next fight for you, April 21st? Yeah, yeah, can't wait. Great one, had a bit of a gap, I had a wee... A wee niggle, it was sort of nursing. I was hoping to get out in a wee small hall show in Belfast, but just had a wee niggle, so thought best to miss it. I want to miss a big show for it. Yeah, it's April 21st, massive show, probably. You know, it's, everyone always says it, but this time has to be biggest name came to Belfast, and he don't an hour, like, you know, gee whiz, fair play to him. It's probably a great fight, can't wait. Definitely going to be a great night in Belfast. Um, opponent wise, is anything, I know it's a bit early for that. Yeah. Have there anything been discussed potentially who that could be? No, well, I think we're trying to get, we're trying to get some sort of, it'll definitely be a quality opposition, you know, um, like anyone who's starting off, skipping poised it. We've got to give it a bit, bit of a go, but you know, we start falling at the last hurdle. Um, but this time we're really going to crack it up. We're going to, we're going to be going for decent opponents because that's how we're going to get anywhere. Um, so yeah, we're hopefully getting a real good caliber opponent. You know, haven't, hopefully, I'd love to get an eight rounder on it, but it's a packed show, you know, we're going to get an eight rounder, I don't know. If I do, I'd be, I'd be loving it, but if I get a six, I'll be over the moon as well. I know you are the quiet man, when are you going to start calling people out? Never, never. What, mate. never? Never, nah. And probably, it's like you'll see it on Twitter, there's a new Twitter account, have you seen it? No. No. So, it's one of the Belfast lads, obviously, I have a few fingers to point. Harry Barnes, you're saying it's not you, Joe McKenna says it's not him. I don't know who it is. I haven't seen this, but I'm already blaming Paddy. Yeah, yeah, Paddy written all already over it. So it's Paddy. called at Boring Ward Mate. So Boring Ward Mate, because in my sentences, I must say mate about three times a sentence. So it's Boring Ward Mate, so they're just unplanned. And that, that's me, I am boring. Paddy. I am boring. You know, it's. Um, to be honest, it's just. I'm lucky enough to have obviously MTK behind me. Really management, you know, they, they don't have to call anyone out, you know, them boys sort everything out for me, they tell me who to fight, when to fight, and I'm happy enough. So, how's you, mate? All good? I'm, I'm alright, mate. Good. All good, mate. Good. Very good, mate. Seen uh, Christmas was good to you, anyway. Why? <laughs> oh, yeah, I've lost joking. weight. You're actually looking well, yeah, seriously, yeah. you're looking well, mate, you're looking well. Just chilling, chilling, Steve. Chilling, that's the way to um, do it. Yeah, quick thought on the fight from the weekend, did you watch it? I did. I'll be honest, I... It went as it was as easy for Goes as I thought. I, I thought it was going to be easier, but I thought Goes boxed really well and fairness to him. Um, he didn't get caught in a brawl, which you know obviously they're on the threat of. But Eubank, you know, he, he looked he looked very basic in it. Do you not think so? You know, in my eyes, he looked very basic. I actually took Groves and the bookies to stop him within three rounds because I thought Groves was just going to go out and try and blow him out of the water. After obviously last the last fight, I thought he gassed a bit, but this time. Honestly, hands down, I thought he looked brilliant. I thought he looked really well, and I've heard that um, is Bramer, is he, is he pulled out for he's Smith? He's pulled out, oh, yeah. I've heard that. The guy he's fighting, I can't remember his name because I didn't know who it was today. He's a kickboxer, that's his background. He's 13 and I was a pro like boxer. So, we'll see what happens. Yeah, I'm sort of, I'm raging about that. I was looking forward to that one. You know, and I thought, I think that would have been a good, that would have been a good mm. fight. Um, obviously, Smith and Groves in the final now. Well, all going well for Smith. This weekend, and but Groves obviously recovers from yeah, his, his yeah, I shoulder. Yeah, I haven't heard anything about that. Creebank was quick to go on and say, Oh, he doesn't know if there's any claws or he maybe gets the fight now. He might, I don't know. You know, stranger things have happened. That's it, if it does, it's not his fault if it does. You know, he didn't ask for Groves' shoulder to be just a kid. See, how's me being the nice guy again? The nice, you know? quiet guy. That's it, mate. There's no point. <laughs> I can't get if you met my you I think you have met my mum. If I start calling people out, my mum must soon have me a slap and tell me to. Why am I knacking? So it's not me, mate. <laughs> Stephen Ward, thank you very much for talking to Eiffel TV. And listen, we'll definitely catch up with you. Um, see, come, Rocky, come here. Can I just say this? Yep. This is, this is uh, I think I've got this down here. Oh, cruiserweight. <laughs> you keep calling me a cruiserweight here. This could be a future scrap. Uh, I don't know. Two, like you two too much. It's a cruiserweight? Yeah. I keep saying I'm cruiser, I'm not cruiser. 
Do you know what? Rocky from Stocky. Do you know what? Nah, that's, a, that's a better accent than what you Do you want me to come in this interview because he's boring? No. That's ah. my no, no, I wanted to make a point. I wanted to make a point. <laughs> that's Hold why on. you wanted to Rock. cheer it off, I like. Rock, when did you win prize fire? 2011. He's still going on about it now, see? <laughs> When you won prize fight, when I used to interview Rocky, I couldn't get 30 seconds out of him. He just spilling words everywhere, was he? No, it? but he just wouldn't talk. Didn't you, didn't, oh. didn't you, get, the, didn't you get a full-time job after that, though? Yeah, yeah. Oh! oh. It's a few daggers it's coming out. You never interviewed me after, after the win, though. What are you talking about? You never interviewed me after, like, you had prize fight, weren't you? Yeah, just but we were, we, was, we were like just this. starting. Yeah, we mean. were just starting. We didn't really know the protocol. So, anyway, my point was that he didn't used to talk back in 2011. Oh, and now, he won't stop talking unless I go, all right, thanks, Rock. <laughs> For like 10, 15 minutes, he'll just I go. Am, in I one am. sentence, yeah. he won't even break. Yeah. I answered the, answer his question for four or five times at different ways, don't yeah. I? Yeah. Go, around, I go around the blocks and I go through the alley. In fairness, like, it, you might as well. Like, we, I'd be lucky enough to be on Spawn with Rock. Like, have, you got, have you got subtitles for this? No, we get him. Do you know why I was about to pay him a compliment there and say, like, yeah, it's not to, that strong to say, compared to some other people. Compared to Paddy, Paddy definitely does need a change don't right now. Even I still don't understand Paddy. I know. To be honest. But he just. Saying, you know, he's Steve's coming on and that he's going to be the next light heavyweight. He's just called out Bivol. Oh, that, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. just called him out. Yeah. What? You did? I haven't called out no one. He just called out Bivol. He's not called out. After quiet when, man. The when the camera's off, he, he tells us that he wants it. He wants <laughs> <laughs> but I ain't going to say it here. Rock, I, Rock should be on that and this year, world title anyway. I was. <laughs> I'd be honest, I was in spot. We, went in, we got in spawn before, before the last fight. It was before the last fight, wasn't it? Jason, I'd be, he peppered me, like, he peppered me, so I'm fucking big things this year. Yes! Uh, Give me that 20 quid there, Rocky, you're asking. <laughs> you come at me, come yeah. at me, once a man, and I'll try and knock me head off, though. Ah, it did, oh, I actually did. But, uh, but no, so like, like, no, I mean, like, Jim's, Jim's pumping. It's yeah. great crack, like, all the lads on, having a better laugh. What? Kai, Kai Obi last week was unreal. What would you do if I just tied with this video? Like, I will smash your face in Kovalev, says Stephen Ward. Like, if you saw that title, Do I don't know where it stopped. But I was just saying about, yeah, you getting a bit vocal. You've got to start, you've got to start calling me. So I reckon you're never going to call anyone out, ever. I, I, I never, like, when you work for my like MTK, you don't have to call boys. Like, do you know what I mean? They sort of Yeah, but they can me. make the matchups. But what I'm saying is that you're the voice. I know, I have a voice with me and my manager. You know, we talk. I don't have to go on and say, oh, you, you're a... But Listen. you know what though, you get to realise that you fucking, you have to start doing that to get anywhere because you don't, if you don't do it, you're watching on Twitter and people doing all call outs. How many fights get made on Twitter? Seriously, fight. genuinely I know. Well, well, what I do, I'll, I'll, a bit of... I'll text Rocky and tell him who I want to, and he'll come on. Let him, him, let Rocky run dirty your work. Twitter for too, one day. No, that's too far, no. You'll be sacked in the morning. Have you seen his Twitter, his new one? Tell him about their about boring that. ward mate. Who did it? I don't, I don't know. Obviously, we don't expect you to say on camera. No, I don't know. I don't know. I don't he does know, obviously. I Clearly don't. knows. It has to be. It, I don't know who it is, but like, you know what the worst is? People are. Did you see Bellu tweeted him? <laughs> Bellu like, like, knocked like, out. Like, like, the stupid thing is that people people follow born word mate that don't even follow me on Twitter, <laughs> which I don't understand. That's great. So like, I'm going on, and then. People are tagging me on their comment. Tony Bellew, they're writing the Tony Bellew. Bellew messaged me, he's message me, said, who's this Steve, can he come down for some spam? He talked to But here, it. not he you, actually the parody did. account. Bellew actually, Bellew actually tweeted him back because he was saying, oh, 30 minutes Q&A, and whoever's on the mic, this stupid Twitter man, tweeted him back saying, it's now 32 minutes past, is it okay to ask a question? <laughs> and he says, Bellew writes back, goes, yes, go ahead, go ahead, pal. And he tweeted him, do you know the car from my best mate? Like, <laughs> I like this account. I might have to follow it. People are going to follow it now, by the way, you mentioned Aye. it. That's funny, but, that's funny. Um, Stephen Ward Underslash would be the real one to follow. That's the, actually the more exciting one. The blue tech one, the blue tech guy. So. All right, Stephen, Rocky, thank you very much from Jarfo TV. We'll definitely Brilliant. catch up with you ahead of, obviously, next week, uh, March the 3rd, and you, April the 21st. Okay, well. Thank you very much. Thank you.